Welcome back. Hi, uh, part-time chef Todd Meany here with our good friend, Chef Rocco Whalen from Fahrenheit. Rocco, how you been? Todd, good morning. How are you, brother? Doing fantastic. How are things uh, at Fahrenheit? Things are good uh, here, there, everywhere, uh, working through everything. As we get going on these recipes week after week, we've elevated our game. We're doing a crab cake today, which is, I think, important to Northeast Ohio to learn how to make a really good, consistent crab cake recipe. So without further ado, Todd, okay. let's hammer. All right, so um, peppers and onions. You got a red bell yeah, pepper. Yeah, olive oil, a little salt pepper, peppers, onions, Todd. You can really uh, you can put garlic, you can put uh, red onions, you can put white onions. This is an ad lib experience for you to call an audible if you'd like to. Get that moisture out of those onions, get that moisture out of those peppers, yeah. get that natural flavor and sugar. The reason we do that, Todd, is the moisture can make the crab take loose. We don't want that. We're going to thicken it up with eggs. We're going to thicken it up with the best mayonnaise in the world from Carolina, Dukes. I love that, we're Dukes. we're going to it up with some panko breadcrumbs. So. Now, I was talking, so the panko I've cooked with before, but I never knew the history behind it. So they actually, yeah. they cook it with uh, an electric oven. They actually don't use the, uh, a regular oven, so it's no crust on it, which is how they get, get it to be so, so kind of, you know, it's crispy. crispy. Yeah. It's crispy. It's light in color so that when you go to brown those crab cakes on both sides in a little butter and oil, it's going to be nice and golden brown for you. So listen, guys, yeah. all these ingredients came from the grocery store, less than $20. This cake recipe is going to feed eight people. Eight ginormous five-ounce crab cakes, Todd. <laughs> this is good for the weekend. Right. This is good for no fans, Indian games. This is also good for Saturday night, Stipe going in and beating the heck out of Daniel Cormier for UFC 252. And so still. this is why the recipe was put together. So we've got our peppers and onions sauteing, yeah. sweating till they're translucent. Talk about your crab meat, Todd. You know, you can buy crab meat that's six dollars a pound or six dollars a can or eight dollars a can. What did we spend today on the crab meat? We, we, went, on, we went for the uh, upgrade. We went 20. I decided to go okay. on the high end. But there were some That's other okay. ones that were there. Jumbo lump crab meat yeah. comes from the ocean, east coast, west coast, up towards Alaska. Yeah. And then again, that's more king crab meat, but snow crab as well. East coast crab meat comes in the can. Uh, it's preserved in the can, so it stays. It's like pickled a little bit. It's nice. Right into your, right into your bowl with your mayonnaise. Go okay. right ahead. All right. Dump that in there. Your panko. Panko's in there. Go. Yep. Your eggs, crack two, no shells, please. Okay. One's the most the one handed, but I, I, it's not, not worth it today. You're one hand, you're one hand bandit. I know that. <laughs> uh, by the way, happy birthday. You've got a birthday in the family today. We got a son turned 18, correct? My son Max is 18 today. Thank you so Max, much. Yeah. Maximus. Oh, yes, sir. And he's leaving for college so, next week. Yeah. So the other ingredients, you know, natural pairing for crab mustard. I yep. use a little Dijon. You can use yellow. I mean, the, the better, the French, the, the, the tastier it's going to be. Yep. Uh, salt, pepper, obviously. Yep. And then the, what do we have on the remaining ingredients? We got uh, we got the Worcestershire. You got to have that for this, yep. right? I got the Old Bay. It's, one of those things. it's an accompaniment. A little cayenne, a little Old Bay, whatever your season. You want a little spicier, just cayenne. But I like Old Bay. Go ahead. A uh, little bit of lemon juice. And for David, a little bit of parsley. I love David, love parsley. Lemon juice brings out the flavor of the crab, marries well with the egg, marries well with the mayonnaise. Peppers and the onions look like they're ready. Yep, they're, we're good to go. You want those in there too? Yes, sir, fire right. them in there. Now, if we weren't doing the magic of TV, we'd probably let those vegetables cool down just a little bit. Sure. But for the magic of TV, we're just going to mix it all together carefully. All right, I'm going to use my hands. Mayonnaise. Go ahead, mix yeah. it all with your hands. That's why I work gloves. Todd. Get dirty on the 30, get dirty on this Thursday morning, my man. We've got the crab, the panko, the mustard, the citrus juice. We've got the eggs, the Duke's mayonnaise. We've got the panko breadcrumbs. Substitute regular breadcrumbs, substitute Italian seasoned breadcrumbs. Yeah. Doesn't matter to us at home. We're just making the best appetizer that's going to show up at the um, at the festival this weekend or whatever you guys are doing. All right, so you want to separate these? Into, how big How big you want the patties? Three, four, five ounce patty. Yeah. That's like, uh, that's that's pretty pretty good. That's yeah. that's aggressive, but good. So <laughs> hot oil. Okay, I can go a little less, fine. And really, Todd, you know, go back and forth like you're making a meatball. Yeah. Like really pack that crab in with the mustard and the yeah. mayonnaise and the citrus. All right, you're good to go. Right, right. into a hot pan. Going in. You're going you're gonna to hear it sizzle once you hit it the oil. Yep. Say and we then, do uh, two. We're gonna fin I'm going to do two in the pan right now. We're going to finish these up, and then, Rock, we're going to come back. Uh, yep. and, and have you uh, see how we finished it all off. And I'm going to have Christy try this because she is very excited about it. Uh, Team she, Meanie, yeah. just the fact that we're doing a crab cake, I got a tear rolling down my uh. cheek, man. We've come so far. <laughs> Corn salads two weeks ago, <laughs> right. tomato salads four weeks ago. 
Cleveland, Fox 8, my family, crab cakes for you. Come up at the end of the show. You got you. We'll see you a little bit. Thanks, Rock. Appreciate that.